What is up you guys? It's your boy Ryan from NKS Outdoors. Welcome out to the channel you guys where we do everything hunting, fishing, trapping, coyotes, frog gigging, you name it. And if there's something that y'all want to see, my email is down in the description. Email me. I will let you guys know if we can do it or not. But we are here back in Michigan you guys. We just got back from South Carolina from a mini little vacation. We went to a wedding there. We were fishing. We were bass fishing. We did a little bit of treasure hunting. You guys need to check it out. Link is down in the description. Go check it out. And uh, we just dropped $3,100. Are you freaking kidding me? Y'all want to see what we bought? Let's just get to it. We just dropped some money, you guys. We just bought two big items, you guys. Two things that I have never had in my entire life and I've always wanted to have. We bought a 2002 Dodge Dakota and it has 149,000 miles on it. We paid 2,600, you guys. I don't know, I might have gotten ripped off. I have no idea, you guys. But the truck looks, sounds, and drives fantastic, you guys. Look at your boy. This thing is pristine, boy. Look at the bed, nice and clean. I'll eat a cheeseburger off that thing right there. And I know you guys are like, dude, what a hook of jump. <laughs> you beg the difference. Just look at the crisp. Just look at the crisp, you guys. Very nice, very nice. We paid 2600 The guy wanted 28 and we tried to talk him down to 25 He said he can't do it. Um, so we got 26 for it. But that's not the only thing we got, you guys. And I know you guys are like, dude. Like, you bought a truck. What else could you have bought for $3,100? I mean, this could be a piece of crap, too. Absolutely not, you guys. This could be freaking sick. A freaking boat, you guys. We finally got a boat. I've never had a truck. I've never had a boat. We have both, you guys. Look at that. Look, oh my gosh. Just look how beautiful it is, you guys. The boat is a sea nymph. I don't know how to pronounce it, you guys, to be honest with you. Sea nymph. I don't know. But we only paid $500 for the boat and the trailer. So, I mean, you really can't beat it, you guys. That's not it, you guys. This vidja is for the boat y'all we are going to be doing a full restoration on this thing i pretty much already sanded the whole thing we patched up all the holes with some uh um, marine jb weld when i bought the boat the guy was like you know there's a couple leaks in there and me and my buddies we have a little super soaker that we just fill it up and just suck the water right out of you know bro i am not doing that the boy is not going to sink with camera gear but we are going to be decking this whole thing out we are going to be putting a deck all the way up to i believe the seat right here and then we're gonna be covering the whole ground possibly with some plywood we're gonna be carpeting the whole thing we just bought a mini coda motor uh for 75 bucks are you freaking kidding me so we're going to deck this thing out it's already sanded all the holes are packed and she floats you guys so we're gonna go to my mom's house paint this thing you like this boy <laughs> Alright guys, so we just got to my old house that I actually grew up in, guys. Look at this little baby house. Oh my god, look at this baby. No, this is actually where I grew up, y'all. A lot of great, fine memories. But we are here for your boy, the boat. We sanded everything. We are going to put a primer on it really quick. And then we are going to just paint this whole thing. And once we get it painted, we're going to have to build a platform. We're going to have to put the carpeting down. We have all of our spray paint. I mean, we got, I mean, like when I say we got spray paint, I mean, we got some spray paint um we have some camouflage two times ultra cover for john boats rust-oleum and then we have the primer uh the self-etching primer from rust-oleum so we are gonna paint this guy we're gonna get right into it Yes, outdoors, you guys. Look at this. We're all done with the John boat. Um, this it looks pretty freaking nice, you guys. So uh, we're gonna take this guy. No, I'm joking. We're, it's just fast motion. This. <laughs>
We are back here at my old house, uh, and it is day two, you guys. We primered the whole thing, and... All right, listen, I already started painting a little bit, you guys. I apologize for you guys not to see it, but, I mean, I did a little bit. It's like, uh, not even a quarter of the boat. But, you know, we just did the seat, you know. We just did the seat. It's kind of hard to tell with the shadowing, and I apologize for that. But these stupid trees right here are just... Uh, <laughs> We painted just from the sea till about right there. I mean, yeah, you can definitely tell from back here. Just the sea and then just till about the bars I just painted. Yeah, so we're just going to get into it, you guys. So we are using the camouflage and the Rust-Oleum 2 times Ultra Cover for John Boat. I mean, there's John Boat on it. I mean, I guess it's for it. Yeah, I know. I got a peanut tattoo. Guys, I would uh, strongly advise to wear a mask because I feel very funky, you guys. I don't like it. I don't like it, you guys. I don't feel funny. <laughs> wear a mask. <laughs> Day three, you guys. Day three, I'm painting the boat, y'all. Dude, look at my hair, you guys. It looks like Lloyd Christmas from Dumb and Dumber. Have y'all ever seen that? One of my favorite movies. But look at the boat, y'all. I mean, she looks flawless, you guys. I mean, it looks like, I mean, the whole thing just looks fantastic, you guys. So all we have to do is we're going to sponge paint this whole thing. I did a little bit of the back, y'all. So I got a sponge. We cut the sponge out. And then, you know, we just start dotting it, pretty much. We're just doing different size dots, so it don't all look the same. It's going to look fantastic. Ladies and gentlemen. It's looking like a boat, you guys. I mean, it's looking very nice. I mean, we just got done with the sponging, and now it's onto the seagrass. Look at the stencil, you guys. I mean, it looks pretty good. I mean, she looks good, you guys. So the spray paint, you guys, we're going to be using some of the Rust-Oleum, the camouflage, the boat stuff, but the tan kind for the duck grass. Main. But it's going to look fantastic. We're just going to get right into it. But listen, we are very close, you guys. Very freaking close to 100 subscribers, you guys. If we can get to 100 subscribers we will be doing a giveaway i don't know what yet i mean maybe some cash i mean i, I don't know you guys but we are going to be doing a giveaway you guys so we just need to get to that 100 mark if we can get past it that's what we want you guys let's just get into painting this boat and get it done We are done with the boat, you guys. After four long, tedious days of painting this boat, you guys, it's been a long time. My finger hurts from just... Yeah, look at my finger. She's swollen. She's looking like Shrek's finger. If y'all, like, want to see this boat, I need, like, an applause. I need, like, a chant. I need, like, a... Oh, let's go. We are finally done with the boat, you guys, for part one of this vidget, where we're just painting it. She turned out great, you guys. I mean, what do you guys think? Appreciate you guys coming out to the channel. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button. And stay tuned for part two, where we're building everything. And we will see y'all in the next one. Stay tuned. <laughs>